and heating up in our kitchen, presidential cooking. Channel 7 News, Good Morning Arkansas, with Steve Powell, Melinda Mayo, Beth Hunt with News, meteorologist Barry Brand, and special reports from Jason Harper. You mentioned presidential cooking in our kitchen. We have special guest, uh, Marty Mangello. He's a former White House and Camp David chef. In fact, he cooked for the Clintons all those years in the White House. He's back in town uh, with a book and event coming up at the Presidential Library this evening. So we'll meet Marty, maybe find out what Bill and Hillary liked, you know, on those midnight snacks and, and such. Sounds good. Okay. That'd be the best thing about being president is just to have a chef at your own. <laughs> and does it work like that? We need to ask Marty. Can you, uh, I know. Does that work? I don't know. Amazing stuff. Our guest in the kitchen is used to seeing Hillary Clinton around because uh, he cooked for the Clintons and the Bushes as well. Uh, Marty Mangello is here. He is uh, with some uh, able hands to his left and right. He's James going to... and Stormy. Yeah, James uh -huh. and Stormy. He's uh -huh. going to make a, a nice cookie recipe for us, white chocolate Polynesian cookies. But he was the executive chef at Camp David. I know. How cool is that? I mean, what a place to just hang out when you're not having to cook in the kitchen. Yeah, that's yeah. not a place you could just drop by. No, I don't think so. So yeah. he's got some great stories to tell, and uh, we'll visit with him about an event tonight at the Clinton Library. Library as sounds, well. Sounds good. We're going to talk presidential eating coming up right after the break. <laughs> Morning Mangello is here. He was the executive chef at Camp David. Yeah, Camp David. That's pretty cool. We'll learn about the, the job and a great recipe right after this. Well, hard to find many more historic places to work than Camp David, the presidential retreat, but Marty Mangello has worked there under two different presidents as the executive chef. Good to see you. Thank you for having me. Welcome to Arkansas. Yeah, thank you. Love it here. Yeah. How do yeah. you go from, I guess you were a Navy chef? I was Navy yeah. for 21 years. And then right. how do you get plucked out of the Navy to uh, Camp well, David? Well, I was actually underwater on a nuclear submarine when I was nominated, and then you go through a lengthy process. No kidding. Yeah. Yeah, they really look into you and investigate your family. And it was about a year later I, I got a call and said, okay, you can come to work now. Yeah. Yeah. And oh, by the way, yeah. you have to be a pretty good cook. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. well, you're going to make a recipe for us. And I tell you, what, why don't we get started? Because we want to learn sure. more about your, your job as we go along. But uh, what are you calling this recipe? This is a white chocolate chip macadamia cookie. Sometimes we call it our Polynesian cookie. Uh huh. Yeah, and it's got Was a, there a president who really enjoyed these? Uh, Actually, we served these a few times at Camp David, uh -huh. and uh, my fiance and I have been making this recipe even better now. She had an idea to put the dried pineapple in, and it's, it's gotten okay. better Show than ever. Do it. Okay. Well, we're going to start off with a simple creaming procedure, mm -hmm. one and a half sticks of butter, soft is best. Okay. And we've got brown sugar mm -hmm. and white sugar here, so that's pretty typical for a recipe. Three-quarter cup of brown sugar, we'll slide him in. And then a third cup of just regular sugar. All right. And that's pretty easy. Mm -hmm. Nothing difficult there. This is kind of the basic cookie recipe for many cookies. Yeah. One teaspoon. Notice I measured that precisely. I see that. Yes. Yeah. Pure. If you can do pour things out accurately on a submarine, it's easy. Yeah. <laughs> Pure vanilla we like to use okay. instead of imitation. Okay. And if you have a mixer, that's great. Otherwise, you can do it like Grandmom did. Whoa. That's right. Yeah. Which Make is a the, fist. the real way. Uh -huh. Back in the old days, before they had those fancy mixers, All right. and just mix that up. The next ingredient after this, we cream this, is going to be that egg. There, we're going to put one egg in here. So, do you want to get him ready? I cracked him for oh, you there already. You go. Okay. Yeah. Drop him Tell in there if you would. All right. Yeah. So let's just mix him around. Okay. Okay. And that's pretty simple. And after this, we go into the dry ingredients, which are right there to the left. We're going to go with the flour. Mm -hmm. One and two third cup of flour. Get pop All that one in. time. Yes, ma'am. Here we go. You Marty, got you've, got, you've got a book with uh, a bunch yeah. of recipes in it. Is this one of them? Well. My mentor is coming here tonight, White House chef uh, Walter Scheib, uh -huh. and uh, his book has just come out. Oh, it's his book, so okay. So we're going to celebrate that tonight and uh, have a cookery presentation at the Clinton Center. But I'm working on a book good, that good, good. talks about the Navy. Now we have uh -huh. to go on ahead and put a couple little things in here. We're going to do some salt, half a teaspoon. Uh -huh. And we've got some baking soda for leavening, obviously. Baking soda, not powder, and don't mix them up, right? We've got half a teaspoon. Actually, we are going to put oh, a little well. baking powder as well. Okay. Yeah, three-quarter cup teaspoon. Easy enough. Again, as yeah. he's putting this together, we remind you, as we always do here in the kitchen, that these yeah. recipes will, uh, yeah. by the end of the day, be on katv.com. Yeah. yeah. And this we don't want to overmix too much. 
We just want to kind of incorporate this, and now we're ready for all of our crazy ingredients and get into the Polynesian. Yeah, there's aspect. been some chopping going so, on over here. Okay. How about two cups of white chocolate chips? All right, that sounds good. Pop them all in. All at once? Yes, sir, that's all, right. all of them. Good. Now we have a mixture of macadamia nuts and English walnuts. Let's put those in. English walnuts, okay. Yeah. Okay, and we've got some coconut there, dried coconut. Okay. How many dozen? My what goodness. Is, well, this this is maybe, maybe uh, depending on how you roll them. Uh -huh. uh, here we have monster size. Right, yeah. You can make bite size, and then some the dried pineapple. pineapple. Yeah, this is the latest ingredients you yeah. said that you guys Chef have added. Stormy's secret dried pineapple. We may okay. need to, to uh, skip to the monster rolling yeah. before we run out of time. Yeah, and so I this mean, you, you mix up, and we'll put that this? over here. And you're going to end up with a, right. a massive ball. May I roll so, a few just yeah, to see the, the technique here? Let's put it on the pan there. All right, sort of like that. Yeah. I don't know you, about, and we want to we want to compress these. Oh, okay. Ahead, roll it real good. That's a key. There you okay. go. Make it dense. Marty, right. Let's talk about the event because we are uh, pretty much out of time uh, okay. tonight because we want folks to come out and mm -hmm. uh, and get a chance to see you guys uh, in person. Absolutely. Well, tonight we're going to have a you celebration that, go of uh, Walter Scheib the former White House executive chef. Here's the finished cookies we're gonna serve tonight. And we're gonna make a couple of things, uh, sweet potato soup, and he's gonna do a talk and go right into answering questions. The, the question part is usually pretty popular. All right, it is yeah. at the President Clinton uh, Center, and uh, I, we encourage you to go check it out. How long did All we right. bake these? Oh, these are like maybe 10 minutes. Okay, Easy. 350. Easy peasy 350. All right, yeah. there you go. Enjoy yourself. Thanks so All much, right, well, Marty. thanks for having us. Uh -huh. we'll, we'll taste during the break.